Hey, love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favorite and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, just thanking thanking you for taking the time out to see the signs that have been laid off, you know, laid out for you whether or not if it's your dreams or your visions or just things that just float towards your way during your daily routine it's truly a blessing so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know i'm about to upload my next video also, if you are comfortable enough, I would love for you to drop a line or two. I'd love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content in my video, or you're just up telling me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is being very informative to you or just gave you good vibes, you would love to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that are going through some trying times right now and need validation or confirmation towards their soul path or even their life purpose. Please go ahead and share. And while you're at it, give me a thumbs up, like, and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit. Thank you so much for the love and support. It is so greatly appreciated. And I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. And I hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video. And today I'm listening to beautiful sleep music, deep relaxing music, uh, sleep music, sleep meditation music, and music for insomnia. And I will post that link in the description box below. And today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Heyoka is getting a high pitched sound during your upgrades or downloads. It's just like we are becoming more balanced with ourselves. It's like yesterday I was getting so many downloads and it was just like i felt everything yesterday and it was just you know i appreciate the love bugs that took their time out to ask me how i was doing yesterday i really truly appreciate that um just going through all emotions you know if you ever lost a parent um you know how it is just to go through those moments you're trying to stay strong and you know just trying to keep your your spirits up you know knowing that you're getting signals from your loved ones that they're always there with you you know they send signs all the time whether it's through feathers or whether it's a chill that runs up and down your spine or are you you just feeling them you know you might think about them at that moment and you get a chill and it was like i was feeling all those yesterday you know it was really hard for me because you know anybody that knows who my dad is um they have really been expressing their love for him. You know, my dad's music has really got people a long way, you know, as well as me when I was able to listen to it. Um, it was just like going through those emotions. It was, it was like really, it was enlightened, enlightened, but it was really somber at the same time because there's a lot of people that love my dad, you know, for the music he's brought out for, uh, people that you know really use his music to get by you know if you're you're going through things there's always some songs that resonates with you so it's just like a lot of these days it's been passing by and we've been going through these shifts and upgrades it's just like i constantly see you know y'all as one we're all connecting as one we're all in sync as one you know there's a lot of things that i can be putting in video that i tell y'all i go through and you can resonate with it so good it's just like people are like you're telling my story and it's a blessing to be able to put these out on you know put my my life journey on video allow you to be able to take me take these steps with me um being able to know that i'm not alone and you're not alone and it's just like we're when we're getting all these little high pitch sounds it's like we're getting we're going up to our subconscious, I mean, our, our consciousness, that's what I meant to say. Getting all these things because they're getting us ready for the things that are coming our way, uh, the things that we truly need in life. You know, there's a lot of us as empath knows that we're winding down, a, you know, a very emotional chapter in our lives. And you get those feelings all the time. And it's just like when you're getting those high pitched sounds, you probably get chills same time like ooh, like somebody just walked over your grave and they're allowing you to know those are the signals to let you know things are changing for you things are heading your way just you know keep going keep focused you know and i know it's time to get hard trust me i know where there's things placed upon you but automatically as our human human essence 
we we tend to you know get upset when things are not going our way or they're not going fast enough as we're wanting them to you know you might be going towards something working hard for it but you keep hitting brick walls but the universe needs to see that even though you're hitting those brick walls you might get setbacks you might get things that that come in your way those speed bumps but as long as you can be able to take that break when you truly need to but just keep your eyes focused on the things your heart your soul focused on the things you're really trying to manifest in your life don't ever think about the things you don't want think about the things you do want even if, i know it can be hard at times especially when you're going through certain cir circumstances that leaves you overwhelmed that leaves you stressed out you know there's things that's in your past you probably deal with narcissistic people on a daily basis they understand that they understand that but it's just like that's what they're there for your your archangels are there for your spirit guides are there for you know when you need that help they always ask you know standing there waiting on standby you know saying hey if you ever need my help with these certain situations when it's taking away worries taking away fears concerns insecurities you know they're these things when you're putting on forefront and you're letting the universe know if this thing is going to serve you in a higher purpose they want you to be able to put it out and say you know what hey i'm working for this in my life you know i really need help you know maintaining that that thought process having a one-track mind when it comes to things i'm really trying to focus on on bringing to my life that's going to blossom you know have me on that glow up you know we're all manifesting stuff like that and it's okay to have a bad day not everybody's gonna have a good day every single day you know so it's just like you have to be able to find blessings throughout that day you know when things go good even when you just made it through that day without any you know drama they want you to be able to say you know what thank you you allowed me to get through this day and it wasn't as stressful as i thought it was you know because sometimes we make a mountain out of a molehill we do that and it's just like going through so much i know with me going through so much it was like my birthday which was you know on the 19th of last month um i never really cared about my birthday like that you know because i felt like there was always something missing and i always told god thank you for allowing me to see another year because he didn't have to do that you know being able to be blessed and be able to see another year being able to know this is one more year that I can be able to gain the wisdom that I need to have, helping people where they need to be helped at, you know, sending out blessings towards people, especially that truly need it, knowing, you know, I have to keep telling myself, no matter how much stressful stuff I go through, keep it positive. You know, it was just like between my birthday and then my mom's birthday was on the 28th of last month. Then my dad's birthday was just Friday and Father's Day is coming up. So I'm just like, all these things, you know came in my mind you know the ego wants me to constantly keep thinking about what my family has put on me and it's like how much they did to me where I wasn't able to meet my family and I had to really come to terms with that you know things happen for a reason even though that's a messed up situation to ever have to go through you know I can say I'm blessed because I keep telling myself, yes, you didn't get a chance to meet your family. Yes, you know, your a lot of relatives have passed, but even though you had that spiritual connection with them on the other side, I talk to my grams and my grandpa all the time. And um being able to know that, you know, bigger days are out there. And, you know, when I cried today, I hurt my grams and my mom, especially my dad. They were, kept on telling me, let it go. You know, we you need to go ahead and release that. You know because there was a lot of things i was holding in it's just like you know i get to that point where i want my twin and then there's times you know i go into my little childlike mode and say i want my daddy and going through all those things i know that they're there you know always around me when i truly need them to be and that's a blessing so it's just like when i needed that i know my spirit world you know with my my one my loved ones that have passed on those high pitched sounds is coming from them too so they're all out you know saying hey we have your back so anytime you're going through things and you, you like yesterday i knew something somebody was talking not good about me in my ear because it was just like that left ear was high pitch and it felt like somebody was like you know doing some high pitch sounds but then right after that happened i got so many downloads when that happened and then next thing you know, that let me know, hey, I'm resonating with my consciousness. I'm allowing myself not to let those negative things that people place upon my life 
uh, allow that to keep me down. You know, I said people don't always talk about you, especially when you're intimidating. You're if your vibe and your you know your essence is very intimidating to people. That of course expect you got to expect not to be liked. You're gonna have it expect that people are going to you know and make you feel like you're inferior to them even though that's not what kind of vibe you're giving off but when your light shines a lot brighter than other people because you stand out you don't have to do anything to stand out you just stand out anyway you know people get intimidated by that so allow yourself to see the signs that are coming towards you allow the universe to be able to send that love towards you when you desperately need it because there's a lot of times we'll be in our feelings we'll be stressed out we'll be angry but when they're trying to send us that love to help us to keep going so they can lighten that load for us you know sometimes we block that by being upset you know and it's just like I have to tell myself Allow yourself to be upset for that second, but also allow yourself to not get so caught up in that emotion that you're you're taking your blessings away, you're blocking them. So allow yourself to be able to take that that sign. Allow those messages to be able to come in because I feel a lot of y'all have been getting them lately. It's like you catch yourself daydreaming and you're seeing little snippets. Like you, you, it's just like when you know you're going through something, you're already sitting on the edge of your seat, knowing there's things coming in your life. You, it seems surreal to you, but you're getting those little snippets of things that are coming towards your way, or there's things that you totally want in your life that you have been working hard for, and they're trying to send those signs saying, "Hey, things are turning around for you. You're about to end a a very emotional situation, or you're about to." You know come upon something that you truly have been working hard for so allow those things to come in your life allow those things that you've been desperately manifesting to come into your life you know and pay attention when you get those high-pitched you know noises in your ear right along with the chill bumps that comes up along with it so I hope everybody was able to resonate with the content of my video I'm sending my love out to uh michelle no michael ratson much love to you i hope all is well like and subscribe even hit that notification bell drop me a line give me a thumbs up let me know if you resonate hit that bell subscribe share and i'll see you on my next video know that you are truly blessed highly favored forever loved and know there's always someone out there praying for your better days and no um Send out as much positivity and love that you possibly can. You never know your what your kind word kind words really take somebody a long way. So I'll see you in my next video. Much love, peace. Be wise.